extremely honored that uh, today Mr. Lieutenant General Vinod Ji Khandare have graced us with his presence, ladies and gentlemen. And I would like to request the gentleman who is a principal advisor with Ministry of Defense, Government of India, to please step up here on the stage and share the wisdom with all the wonderful people who are present here. Everybody, put your hands together for Lieutenant General Vinod Ji Khandare. Good morning and Jai Hind to all of you. Uh, it gives me a feeling of uh, being the opening batsman in the T20 match. And uh, obviously I've been told that this has to be short and sweet. Uh, I want to give my views very briefly, but uh, giving out important things. When we look at a nation and we look at the comprehensive national power, along with that, we look at the comprehensive national security also. Uh, simultaneously, when we get digitized at a fast pace as it is happening today, uh, there are vulnerabilities also which come up. So there has to be a very delicate balance which has to be maintained uh, between the growth, that is the development and the security. Uh, it impacts the armed forces uh, to a large extent because uh, the nature of wars or the natures of conflicts is evident to all of you. You are seeing what is the geopolitical situation. You are seeing what's happening in Russia, Ukraine, what's likely to happen towards Taiwan. And everything is based on a compression because of the digitization of the space. So here we are looking at the traditional forms of uh, comprehensive national power and also the new forms and in these new forms, we have new domains like the cyber space, information. Everything is weaponized. Everything is leveraged. So towards that extent, uh, we all look at our nation also. And we want connectivity right up to the border. And our honorable prime minister has said that we are looking at the frontier villages as the first villages. People used to call them the last villages. We are looking at them as the first village. And that's where we need connectivity. And that is useful dual purpose. That is the civil military fusion, which is essential. And that can be achieved by uh, digitization. Uh, while we are looking at digital India, it's extremely important to look at data, big data analysis, AI. And all these are extremely important to empower us to do our job much better. Ministry of Defense looks at many issues in that defense production is also there. And there also we look at uh, getting empowered with more and more digital growth. Another uh, major issue which has happened is the Gati Shakti. The Gati Shakti which brings all of us together and we don't waste our resources and the most important resource being time. When we look at, uh, look at our identified adversaries, there is a substantial gap, a differential between us and our northern borders. And that can be enabled if all citizens, all segments of the government, so we need to have a whole of government, whole of nation approach. And that is what will take us uh, rapidly towards becoming a kind of a power. We don't want to be the only power, but we want to be somebody to be considered important in the geopolitics of the world. So that is how the uh, contribution of the private sector is equally important. And uh, the uh, growth that we are seeing, uh, simultaneously, we all have to be sensitive. In cyber domain, the weakest link would normally be a citizen. And that is, which ne that is what needs to be empowered. And I would conclude my uh, short talk here by saying, that it is a team effort. Let us all work towards a digital India. Thank you. Jai. Thank you so much, sir. sir. We would like to obviously thank you. So we would like to request you to please stay just for another minute. Or sath sath request karna chahenge Ms. Tanya say to please come forward and do the honor by felicitating the gentleman. Sir, please here in the center.